disappointing, I guess, Neil, with the uh, the result. Just the result. I thought the performance was good. I thought for half an hour we were a better side, first half. You know, and um, I don't think anybody could argue with that. I thought the goal, their goal came the ten minutes before half time where they got on the ascendancy, but obviously they're gonna they're at home. Um fantastic strike, you know, from Carriol. You know, we know he's capable of that. You know, we give him too much space in around around the box, but it's still a super strike. Um second half we come out, we change it around, we go four four two again. We're in the ascendancy. You know, but we just didn't have enough cutting edge today. You know, we didn't have that edge to get his noses in front, you know, when we had his bits of play. Um, and obviously the, the, the second goal is a cock-up. You know, both from played through and, and obviously the keeper's got to come on to it and do better. And league camp's been fantastic for us, particularly recently. Um, but obviously he's, he's got to do better in that situation. Um, so 2-0 flatters them a little bit. Probably Leeds deserve to go through, perhaps. Um, but I've got to be pleased with aspects of the performance, and you know, obviously now we've got to move on and you know and, and, and take Brighton on on Tuesday. You kept changes quite minimal. Right? So I think a lot of people thought you might have made a lot more changes than you did. With nobody to change, that were it. Eleven and seven subs, mate. You know what I mean? And with um, obviously young Mason Warren on the bench, we've got injuries, we've got people out, people moved on. Um, we're looking to bring people in, but that's that's all we had. Eighteen players. Are you looking to bring more in throughout the window? Yeah, yeah. We're looking to strengthen. We've got people in mind. You know, we, we, we want to bring people in to try and help the lads that are here. I was really pleased with the way the lads applied themselves today. You know, particularly in that first half, I thought we got us tactics spot on again. I thought we made Leeds look a bit predictable, if I'm honest, for half an hour. Um, you know, they got caught offside quite a lot. We kept an eye line, broke on them really well. You know, got in around the final third and then just, just didn't have that quality. But, you know, quality costs money. And, um, you know, but we're, we're doing all right. You know, we've just got to stick in there. And looking at it ahead, you know, where do you feel you are in the bat battle to stay in the championship? Oh, yeah. yeah, we're in a battle to stay in it. We've been in a battle since day one, you know, and we're in a battle last season and, you know, we've, we've just got to keep doing what that word, battle, you know, we've got to keep going. Um, we've proved on us day that when we've got everybody fit and we've got everybody at it, we're capable of winning winning games. You know, in the last eight previous to the two we've had in the cup game with, with four wins, you know, so we've proved we can beat people. You know, we beat Leeds down here at Ellen Road, probably. When it mattered, probably, you know what I mean, the three points in the league. Um, so, we're, you know, we're, we're doing all right. We just, you know, but to, 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 to survive at this level and, and, and to thrive at this level, you, you, you need that quality, you know, particularly in the final third and in and around, in and around the box. And, and obviously, you look at the goal today from Carriol, you know, it's a bit of quality, you know, in something that, you know, where Leeds were probably struggling in and around the box to go and create and score. And it, it, was, a, it, was, a, it was a touch of quality that won the game. So... Um, and it's that touch of quality that we need to add to this squad. What positives then do you take out of today? Performance. I thought, like I said, for half an hour, and I think it's difficult for people to deny that. You know, for half an hour, I thought we were the better side. I thought we looked strong at the back. Um, Eamon Belaid, left side centre back. I thought he had a good game. You know, he looked strong. Won his headers. Looked, got pace. Um, I thought we broke quite well. I thought John Ewell looked bright on the left. Um, but again, you know, we're making our subs with Tuesday in mind. You know, we're taking Danny Ward off, who's been as better, one of his better players, and and Grant Ward, one of his better players, because we've got Tuesday. You know, which is, you know, which is important to us. And, and obviously, we're not saying that the cup game is important, but you know, we haven't got a big squad. You know, we've got what we've got, and we, we, you know, with that in mind, you know, that's why we made the changes. I know you're rather a manager now, but just a word for Louis Coyle, obviously someone that was under your tutelage. Here at Fantastic, League. yeah, great to see another one of mine getting in. You know, he's. Um, and when I say one of mine, they are, you know, because I was there six years and, you know, that's six years with the players. Um, but the kid's done great. You know, if I'd have been here, he'd, he'd have had his chance this year, um, along with others probably. Um, so, you know, fantastic to see him come in. I thought he looked assured. I thought he played well, Louis, you know, and, uh, and obviously that's coming from the opposition manager. So good luck to him. Are you close to bringing any more in, Neil? Yeah, 